What's up everybody? Today I'm going to be showing you how to get InEdit for Minecraft. It's basically just an inventory editor. Um, you can give yourself whatever you want in Minecraft. I do have the most recent version that will work with Beta 1.3. Um, see if we type in bed. There's the bed. And the redstone repeater. So now I'll show you how to get it. I'll show you how to use it afterwards. You want to go to this website. It's just the Minecraft forums. I'll put the link in the description. And you're also going to need um, WinRAR because it'll be a zipped file. So you're just going to go ahead and scroll down to download and then do click me. Save it to your desktop. And then gonna go ahead and open it. Let me put this in recycling bin so it doesn't try to copy over it. Take your this folder and drag it to your desktop. And that we don't need this anymore. So now we're gonna go ahead and open it. And now how to use it, um, you can go ahead and whatever world you want to put stuff into. Uh, let's see I have four worlds. I'm gonna go ahead and do world two say I want some clay I don't know why I'd want clay but say I want some clay um, and then for count you can give yourself 64 64 and I th I'm pretty sure the max max amount you can give yourself without it glitching out is 244 so you can do that and then another cool thing you could do is say you want a diamond pickaxe but you don't want it to break. So what you do is you do negative for damage. You do negative one, 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 one. Just put a whole bunch of ones, and then it changes it to thirty-two thousand six hundred fifty-seven, and it'll be green letters. And that basically what it does is you can destroy a whole bunch of blocks, and it won't break. It won't even start to break for a long time. So you'll have this pickaxe for a very long time. You could do the same thing with um, armor. Make sure you do negative because if you don't do negative, it'll just be broken when you get into the game. And what you could also do is you could take non stackable items and make them have more than one. So it'll be so you could store more things in chests. And then what you're also going to do is when you're finished giving yourself everything you can go ahead and go to save and then save to whatever world you want it to be saved to so I just saved it to world 2 and then you can go back into minecraft and everything will be there now to always have the most recent version you're just gonna go ahead let me check and see if this is the most recent version real fast yeah, see, I don't have the bed. So what you're going to do to get the most recent version without having to find the download for it is just do check for updates and then download, then restart. And it'll restart, and let's search for bed again. And now the bed's there. So now you will have the most updated version. So it's really simple to get, really easy to use. It's easy to always have the most updated version of the program. So that's pretty much it. Um, if you noticed earlier, now it just looks like the invent it just looks like a normal folder, but my folder before had this little icon. If you want that icon to be on this folder, just go ahead and right click it, go to properties, then customize, change icon, then you're gonna want to browse. And what you're gonna do is gonna go to desktop, invent and then you're gonna click on this and then open and then it'll put that icon there you should OK apply and OK again and now you have the icon so that's that's pretty much it um, I hope this helped you guys out and thank you for watching I'll see you guys next time